hello, hi, hey, but before everyone starts raging and screaming, before what I'm about to say, I need everyone to keep calm. Be nice in the comments. Don't freak out. It's not the end of the world. Ty Gibbs is a 2022 Xfinity Series champion. I said it, okay? Just, it, it happened. It just happened, okay? Yeah, anyways. All this for a Ty Gibbs championship. I mean, seriously. After last week, and the way that everyone was talking and everyone was freaking out, you thought that Ty Gibbs wasn't going to finish this race. He won the race, and he won the 2022 Xfinity Series Championship. Seriously, all that for a Gibbs Xfinity Championship. He took the most difficult route possible. He made some people mad this season. He wrecked his teammate last week, and he still won the championship. And I'm trying to think of, I was going to say credit to him, Credit to him today. He drove incredibly today. The team did incredible today. He had a great car. And he had some great battles. And he kept it clean today. He didn't wreck anyone. He didn't run anyone in the wall. He raced fairly clean today. So today, you know, credit to him. As for how he got here, still uh, uh, need some work. But regardless, I know people are going to hate no matter what. They're going to be like, oh, Ty Gibbs still sucks. I still hate Ty Gibbs. People are going to have their opinions. Everyone's allowed their opinion. But he still won, you know? Um, people are going to talk about last week a lot. And, heck, one of the first things he talked about out of the car was last week. He was like, I once again apologize. I can't apologize enough. It's so bad for the organization, blah, blah, blah. People are going to focus on that a lot, and it's understandable. He was already advanced into the championship four. Jones needed the win, but he still won. Joe Gibbs Racing still got the championship, so, you know, not all was lost, Is I guess I can say. Look, we could focus on last week all we want. I've already made a video on it. We're ta we've talked about it for two minutes already. But the fact of the matter is, let's talk about today, Ty Gibbs won today, and he won his first Xfinity Series championship, and I guess his only, because he's probably going to Cup next year. Anyways, uh, great drive for him. He led 125 laps, really dominated the day. Um, he had some great battles today. It was a very fun race. Phoenix has really been kind of a meh track in terms of racing. But so far this weekend, we've seen some fantastic racing. The racing for the Truck Series Championship yesterday between Rhodes, Zane Smith, Chandler Smith was really fun. Uh, and today between Noah Gregson, Justin Allgaier, and eventual champion Ty Gibbs, it was fantastic. Multiple lines. They were running all the way up at the top, under the apron, middle, wherever it was, wherever they could get grip. They were fighting for the win. And they had to conserve the tires because there was some tire wear. It was a very, very, very fun race today. One of the best Phoenix races I've seen, honestly, uh, in any series. So it was very fun to watch those three fight for the win, fight for the championship. But at the end, the best car of the day and the best team of the day won the race. And with this format, that means you win the championship. Once again, I know there's going to be a lot of backlash for this, but at least Gibbs kept it clean today. At least he didn't take out the JRM guys. At least he raced everyone with more respect than he has earlier in the year or last week. You know, you give him crap all you want. Today he was respectful. Sure, he took the very, very, very dangerous road to get here. But the Xfinity Garage, as much as they hated that move last week, no one stopped him from winning the championship. I think the biggest challenge was Sam Mayer. With about two or three to go, Sam Mayer was getting lapped by him, and he raced him hard. Like he didn't pull, he didn't pull over, he didn't block him. Like park at the bus in front of, of in front of him either. But you know, he made it difficult for him to lap him. You know, gave Gregson about a tenth or two. So um, no one really tried to take out Gibbs. No one tried to put him in the wall. Uh, Gregson and Allgaier fought him hard and fair though. And, you know, Gregson talked about how he was going to race him differently. He didn't say he was going to wipe him out, but he said he was going to race him differently. He seemed to race him pretty clean. So if racing him differently is racing clean. I, I don't know what to say. Gregson was talking a lot about Ty Gibbs this week. And even after the race, he was talking about Ty Gibbs. So, uh, yeah, uh, a lot of talk from a lot of people and they didn't do anything. And Ty Gibbs is now the champion. So, um, you can yell at Ty Gibbs all you want, but there were a lot of people who talked this week and they did not live up to the talk because Ty Gibbs still won. So, uh, yeah, talk all you want. 
don't get me wrong. You're allowed to talk. Everyone's allowed to talk, but it's a matter of what you do later. Uh, Brandon Jones never talked. He never said, I'm going to take out Ty Gibbs. I'm going to get him back. Uh, all he said is, I'm ready to get out of Joe Gibbs Racing. And everyone was like, oh, Brandon Jones is taking him out now. No. So I'm not too shocked that Jones didn't take him out. But Jones really never had the opportunity to either. Uh, Gregson talked a lot. Um, he didn't say I was going to take him out. But he's like, yeah, that, that guy sucks. You know, he's disrespectful, all this stuff. And then talking about how he's going to race him differently. And then you let him win the championship. So, um Shades of 2018 with Truex and Logano when Truex said he was not going to let Logano win the damn war. And then Logano won the damn war. Kind of, kind of the same thing here. Anyways, uh, let's talk about it. As I said, Ty Gibbs, he's an Xfinity Series champion. Seven race wins on the season. Regardless of the controversies and the problems he caused this year, still a fantastic season. Seven wins. A championship. Joe Gibbs Racing has now won, what, the last two Xfinity Series championships? Yeah, the last two. So credit to him. You got to give credit to him. Um, Gregson finishes runner-up in the race and the championship his last year with JRM, his last race with JRM before he goes to Petty GMS, Johnson Racing, whatever they're going to call it. Um, fantastic year from him. What, eight, nine wins, however many. Um, just a fantastic year from him. Comes up one spot short of the championship, but still a fantastic year. Uh, you got to give credit to him for the year he had, but unfortunately one spot short. All guy are still looking for that first Xfinity Series championship. Great run for him. Led 26 laps. Finished third in the race in the championship. Had some great battles with his teammate Gregson, uh, with Ty Gibbs. It was a fun race. It really was. And all three of those guys were showing why they were in the championship four because they were all the top three and they were racing each other hard. And then as for the fourth championship four guy, that is... Josh Berry, he finishes 13th. He was up there in the top five most of the race, but after the last restart, washed up the track a little bit, hit the wall, fell back, and ends up 13th. So not a great first championship four appearance for Josh Berry in terms of the actual championship four race, but still a phenomenal season from him with three wins, making the championship four. Uh, but three JRM cars and zero championships this year. Got to be disappointing if you're Dale Jr., but at the same time, uh, Ty Gibbs did a fantastic job uh, today, um, and that's that's all I'm going to say. So now you can go in the comments. Just please be nice. Please be the nicest you can. Just remember, there's, there's, there's Ty Gibbs is still a human being. Just remember that. Anyways, thank you for watching this video. I hope you had a great experience watching the race despite... If you didn't like the winner, I still hope you enjoyed the racing itself. Uh, tomorrow's the cup race. It's the big one. Chase Elliott, Joey Logano, Ross Chastain, and Christopher Bell. Who's going to win the cup title? Let me know in the comments what you think, and uh, I'll see you tomorrow.